pressure cookers function on a very simple principle. In a tightly sealed pot, the boiling point of liquid is higher. Now, as the pot heats up, pressure begins to build. And this pressure makes it more difficult for water molecules to turn to vapor, raising the boiling point from 212 to 250 degrees. The steam generated inside the cooker, at temperatures much higher than what's possible in a normal pot, makes food cook much faster. And because the pot stays closed, cooking requires much less liquid than usual, and flavors concentrate. And as a bonus, this method also uses less energy. Once pressure is reached, you cook with the heat turned down as low as possible, and cooking times are short. Now, we tested 12 brands of pressure cookers and highly recommend this one, the Fagor Duo 8-Quart Stainless Steel Pressure Cooker. Here's why. It's easy to use. It's obvious when the lid is safely latched, and the pressure indicator is simple to read at a glance. It has multiple safety valves and vents. Even if one vent gets clogged, there are several more, so you don't have to worry about excess pressure. Venting steam is easy. You just turn this knob. The Fagor is sturdy, it's made of stainless steel, and it's held up well over time in our test kitchen. It's easy to clean and maintain. Its construction makes it simple to maintain pressure during cooking. It's got a thick, broad base, and that retains heat and keeps temperatures rock steady. It has a good, broad, low shape. The interior cooking surface is nine inches across, giving you plenty of space to brown food for better flavor right in the pot, and then you just seal it up to pressure cook. Some of the pots we tested were skinny. They were just six inches of cooking space. Overall, it has a generous eight quart capacity. It's just right for recipes with four to six servings or for making a big pot of stock, but not so gigantic that it's hard to maneuver. The Fagor Duo eight quart stainless steel pressure cooker is a workhorse, especially if you want flavorful results fast.